What's up guys, Peter Von Panda here. Hey, got myself this Ang Link 200 watt power inverter. And here it is, uh, converts 12 watt DC power from your vehicle and gives it to you in regular good old, good old American two prong power. Uh, the box here is not uh, super big, but what I what I wanted here to take a look at is, I've had Ang Link stuff, always been pretty happy with it and wanted to check this out because it's actually pretty interesting look a little it comes with a little extra fuse kind of your standard little tube fuse there uh, but what i dug about this is i have a power inverter and you plug it into your cigarette lighter and then it has a single plug this one was cool because it has uh two or two grounded regular outlets and then also two usb plugs here so not only could you charge your electronic devices off here but then you could run a uh a laptop off of it or something uh your power brick to your to your tablet or your ipad you could plug in and recharge your electric shaver um you know anything that you wouldn't necessarily have the capability to charge off a USB port on. Now, I know you're saying, Pete, well, this is um, not super unique. Uh, you can see here, here's the 12 volt adapter. Pretty long, so you're gonna have to kind of keep that in mind, but nice and sturdy. Everything on this is pretty freaking sturdy. And then you also don't lose your cigarette uh, power socket there. If you had another device, uh, you could kind of plug it right in there and you know daisy chain it out theoretically so i know which is i was i know what i'm saying uh, you know power inverters aren't super rare or unique but this one was cool because it kind of comes in this power strip form and what i liked about it is that depending on where your cigarette lighter is but you're in your car you know when you put this in there it's not always easy convenient uh to plug something in wherever your cigarette lighter is. So this is kind of nice because it has a pretty generous cord here, about three feet long. So you could run this from the front to the back seat. You know, if your kids or your passengers are using electronics in the back, you could um, make, sh you know, make sure it reaches to your laptop, which might still be sitting on a seat, all sorts of things. I like this power strip uh, feature. Now, the other thing that I'm always curious about is how much load can these things really take and so we're gonna test it out and charge some stuff but not only we're we gonna test it out here at the Panda Institute of Technology we are going to beat the living heck out of this thing and see what we can power with it so let's go out to the car and give it a try all right guys I am inside my Fiat 500 here my power outlets down here and I have the inverter plugged in this is about the humblest car you can actually own and one of the things that i want to show you here is you can see the little led light ring is on around uh, the external uh 12 volt port there and then you have a little led on on the front of the power strip showing that it's on so i've got some stuff here let's see if this sucker works i have an ipad mini right there and a cable and let's go ahead and uh plug it in and boom charges no problem all right all right all right all right so cool now i have a asus power brick here and i have asus laptop if we go ahead and plug it in and now we can see it's charging cool all right so it'll charge a laptop if you're a road warrior now let's give it the ultimate test here and see if we can put in this Helen of Troy hair dryer. You're a real war road warrior and drying hair on the road. Under the hood of the car here because my accessory power outlet fuse is blown because that hair dryer just draws too much electricity as you probably would expect so i've got a new fuse here loading it back in if uh, you have a fiat 500 your under the hood fuse box is this l15 slot which is the fourth one down on this far side just 
pull it out and put it back in. Let's just make sure All it right, works. So back in the car here, got my fuse replaced, pluggy the power inverter back in, light comes on both places. So it is back to working order. So charge all of your electronics, including your laptops, without worry. But don't try to blow dry your hair. Angling 200 watt power inverter. I like it. This is going to go with me on my trips. Peter Von Panda. Out.